All right, you have the Samsung Galaxy. This is the A10e, and it's you feel like it's getting old because it's starting to get sluggish. Here are two ways. One is super easy that you should do, you know, every couple of days, at least once a week. One is going into the developer options, which is going to feel like kind of like you're a hacker, but it's actually simple. Everyone can do it. And I'll show you the changes. I'll show you how to undo the changes, and then we'll compare them to the S10e. So this is A10e, S10e. So let's get into it. The very easiest thing, I just do it on both phones at the exact same time. Let's go into settings. I like to go to settings, scrolling down uh, at the uh, battery. And then inside settings, we want battery and device care. Let's find, here's device care, here's battery and device care. Touch it on this one, touch it on this one. And that's all you do. Every couple of days, you feel phone feels a little sluggish. Come into these settings and then hit optimize now. And that's basically all you have to do. And it might give you, depending on the day and how much you're using the phone, it might tell you a few things that they advise you doing. Closing background apps, maybe you know, deleting some really long videos that you've made, that kind of thing. But for now, that's all you need to do. And do that about, I, I don't know, every couple of days, once a week. All right, now the next thing we're going to do, I'm going to let the S10e stay here, and then we'll make changes on the A10e. And... Let me show you how to do it. Now this time I'm going to go to settings by swiping up and then hit settings. Now inside of settings, I'm going to touch about phone. Inside about phone, I'm going to touch software information. And I'm going to look for build number right here. The words build number. Now all you have to do is touch build number seven times and watch what happens. One, two, three, four. That message should come up. Five, six, seven. Seven, you should see that developer mode has been turned on. Okay, that's all we need to do right here. Now I'm going to back out and I'm going to go one more back to about so we're at the settings screen. And now below about phone, we should now see the developer options are available for us. So now I'm going to touch developer options, it should be toggled on. And now I am going to scroll way down and I'm going to look, see the word debugging here. We're going to look for the word drawing. There's networking. Input should be next. Input and right after input is drawing. Right there, the word drawing. And we are looking for three settings. Windows, animation scale, transition animation scale, and animator duration scale. And all it does, those control how when you switch in between apps, it just kind of controls the animation of that. But changing it, will make your phone feel crisper, snappier, and faster. So watch this. So we're going to touch the first one, Windows Animation Scale. Some people say to put put it on 0.5, the smaller the number, the faster it goes. But I'm going to turn it all the way off. Okay? Transition Animation Scale, I'm going to turn it all the way off. And then the last one, Animator Duration Scale, I'm going to turn that one all the way off. If you do this and you end up not liking it, just come back inside the developer options and turn it back on to 1x. It's as easy as touching it again and then choosing 1x. I'm going to leave it at off for now so we can now compare what the phone looks like and feels like. So let's just do something simple like bring up the phone. Bring up the phone. See how the phone opens into its software. I'll do it, and it closes down into its soft into its icon, grows out of its icon, closes back into the icon. Now watch what happens when we do it on the A10e that we've adjusted. Blinks on. Blinks off. Now let's do them side by side. Oh, that's a big difference in these phones. Now let's close them. Yeah, you could totally see that. Now let's do Messenger. Messenger blinks on. Let's see. You could totally see that. Do it. Do it. It's easy to see here because you know I have two phones side by side, and if you only have one phone, it's kind of hard to see it. But you see how this one just blinks right off, blinks right on, and this one grows into its software and then closes down its icon. Let's do one more together. Let's do camera. Camera kind of seems kind of the same there. Let's let's close camera. Immediately close. This one took a second, hesitated, and then it cl closes down into its icon. And there you have it. I I'm, I'll, I'll go one more time. If you don't like how your phone operates, I'll go over one more time 
to undo the changes. But if you're happy, you want to experiment now and leave those settings like that. Appreciate you watching. Please like, please subscribe. For those staying, let's change the options back. Okay, so let's get back into settings. I'm going to flick up. I'm going to go to settings. Uh, I'm already at the bottom of settings. Developer options. Again, it's, it's drawing we're looking for. Debugging. Networking. Input is next and then drawing right afterwards. So if you want to change it all back to the default, here we go, Windows Animation, Transition Animation, Animator Duration. Let's put them all back to 1x. 1x, next one 1x, and last one, Transition Animation. Oh, I already did that one. Animator Duration Scale, 1x. Okay, and then if you don't want the developer options because you're nervous you might touch something, just turn them off, no big deal. And if you ever want to turn them back on, Last thing we'll go over, see now they're off. They don't show up at the bottom of the phone. Now if you ever want to turn them back on, about phone, software, and build number. Seven times, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Developer mode's been turned on. All right, it's that easy. Hey, appreciate you sticking around. Hopefully this helps you with your older Samsung A10e, or even you can make those changes on the S10e. Please like, please subscribe, and thank you for watching.